Hi, I'm Sina Racina and welcome back to Pokemon Scarlet. This is episode 16 right now, so let's start. Alright, last phase. Oh. Yeah, same thing happened last time I was here. Let's see the last cutscene. Uh, any minute now. There we go. I see, you're almost at the fifth base. Hold, hold up inside is Team Star's last remaining squad. You fought well to make it this far. Thank you, Sina. Sina, Kashipeya. So, you made it as well, Clyde. Of course, it's the last battle. I wouldn't want to miss out on the action. Clyde, I owe you my thanks. Your help has been invaluable for this, to the operation. I'm sorry I was so wary of you at first. Well, that's all water under the bridge. When we are finished with this base, we'll be at the end of Operation Starfall then. Will that be, sorry? Not quite. We'll still need to handle Team Star's secret mastermind last fall. Do we have at least uh, any leads on how to find them? I'm hoping they will come out of, into the open once all the squad bosses have stepped down. I see. We come this far. Only a few more steps left. Don't let me down, either of you. Cassiopeia has hung up. All right. Thanks to you, Sina, I'll slowly but surely come to understand Team Star. I know what I needed to do, and I know what my final decision will be. For that, I can thank you enough. Take care of this base, Miss Sina. Ah, sorry for getting all polite there. Don't know what came over me. So, if I were to uh, write uh, this particular scenario, that Scyther wanted to attack me, but, you know, hit himself with the rock. Tiny bamboo shoot, alright. Uh, what I would have done, I mean, if I couldn't change much, I would have made, made it so, uh, remember that the... The other person will try to delete all the all the information on the bullying. I would have made it so that person was Casupeya and they were manipulating us into defeating the team star members to very you know everything. That's how I would have done it. You know, just give it a little twist. Oh, the leader is right there. You are pretty skilled. Not many trainers can shrug off my Pokemon attacks like that. The same to you. Harry was it? Your Pokemon had to spend a lot of time hunting their moves. But I'm surprised to find the boss herself out here defending the gates. Don't trust you gods drones enough to put them on guard duty? Watch your mouth. I'm here because I don't want to risk anyone else getting hurt, that's all. What a benevolent boss. Now if you want to get on with your battle, I'm already on my side. Yeah, get a closer look at that bishop, what the hell? The background. Who are you? Sina, there you are. I started talking to this girl and she looked like she was with Team Star. Then she and her Pokemon came at me with a warning. We were just battling out. Pretty, I knew you'd be out there. Carmen? Are you okay? You're not here, are you? Fine, honestly. Now get away from here. It's not safe. I'll take over guarding the base. Really, you should get back inside. No, I won't back down. I can't. Oh, Riri, you need to stop this. Until the big boss comes back, I have to protect all of you, the Cap Squad, and everyone else in the Team Star too. That's why you should get back to the base and rest up, even if it's just a little bit. As the boss of this squad, I, I just can't. Riri, please, I'm your friend. Listen to what I'm saying. Fine, I'll go. I'm sorry, Carmen. Hey, that's no way to sign out. Let me hear Hasta La Vista from you. Nice and loud. Hasta La Vista. I'm your opponent now, you two. Come on, I'll take you both down. Hey, Sina. My Pokemon are actually running an empty after that last battle. Sorry to spring this to you, but do you think you can handle this drone alone? Yep. 
Thanks, I'll be cheering you on from the silent. Silent. Sorry. I'll protect Reed with everything I have. You have. You ready to battle? Yeah, I'm so ready. You are challenged by Carmen of Team Star. This should be easy. This is a fighting type uh, phase. Lulu should be able to take care of most of these bozos. Which reminds me, Roy asked me to capture a Mankey for some reason. I should really get to that on the next episode or after I do Team Star. After I, I do the Team Star uh, plotline, I'm gonna take a couple of episodes to capture Pokemon. So, you know, I'm gonna go places, see Pokemon, and capture a new team to battle the gym leaders. I lost, but my defeat is not, is not one that matters. Even if I did, all I did was to buy really, really a bit of time, that's fine, my job here is done, I'll be back inside. Hasta la vista! I take it you defeated the guard of front. That base is run by Team Star's fighting crew, the Cap Squad. Their boss, Eri, is a skilled wrestler and coaches the whole Team Star in Pokemon Battle. Of all the bosses, she's likely the most alert and host to hostilities after the declaration of war. Of war sorry. <laughs> she might try to stop this raid in its tracks by challenging you to a battle before anyone else. You are spot on. Yeah, we already met. I knew it. Tell me what happened. She retreated? We are talking about the same theory, right? Well, it seems there is nothing for it. For it now, but to attack the base head on. Bring the bell on the gates once you're ready to kick off the face of the operation. Yeah, yeah. Just let me just go recover. There is an awful lot of Pokemon around here. To battle the gym leaders, maybe I'll try to capture Pokemon that are uh, local to the area or something. Just to keep things more or less on the same level. So it's gonna be like, capture the first... Uh, I'm gonna check how many Pokemon does the gym leader have and try to, you know, match that number. I think that's fair. Even the smallest stars can love up the sky when they shine together as constellations. We are the last bastion of Team Star, losing isn't an option. Hey kid, you listening? Yeah, you beat 30 of our Pokemon in 10 minutes, the boss, the battle the orc. We know this already. Any chance? Yeah, I think I get it. When when I see the exclamation point, it's when I can send Pokemon. Or not. 
I guess I just need to be, I mean exclamation point, when I see the red arrow, I guess I just have to be close to the enemies in order for my Pokemon to, you know, come out and do their thing. Mm, also Greg, uh, yeah, Greg's almost dead, just to kill Greg. There we go, Greg. Oop. Like, I'm close to it, but... I don't know what was going on there. I don't think we can hold her hold her off much longer, boss. You know, the first time was like, okay, a side to behold, but then it's like, hey, it, it loses the, sh the charm after, you know, the first, the first couple. Okay, I'm ready. Doesn't matter who you are, I'll bury anyone who tries to take down Team Star. This time I won't run away. Ah! Okay, well, I have Gardevoir up front, so that should be okay, right? This base is precious to us, I won't let this raid of you go any further. Ooh. Well, it's toxic growth, so I guess it makes sense. Hmm. Okay, let's try to terrestrialize. Wait, no, I made a mistake! If I terrestrialize, I'm gonna be weak to poison. Like, more weak than before because I won't have the psychic tag to back me up. Whoops. Well, let's put that on my mistake list. Oh, I was faster. Oh well. Sucks to be you. Uh, pa Pasinian. Ah, okay, that's fine. Why does it always rain when I'm battling these bosses? I am surprised Lulu is faster than those two. I mean, it's not a complaint, but... An annihilate? What the hell? Oh, that's why it, it like... Uh, Roy asked me to get a man key. Huh, I might get one for the gym challenge. Oh shit, that's fast! I hear as good as I get, that's a promise. We'll see who's left standing in the end. Well, there goes his an Annihilate. Yeah, Annihilate. It's a cute joke. Lucario. Hmm, Lucario is... Yeah, it's probably faster than me. Let's send out Pancha. No. Ooh, Dark Falls, oof. Oh, how do you like them, Apples? Hey, where's my boost? Oh well. I refuse to lose, so please lend me your strength.
Let's try Torch Song again. Oh, Shift Gear. It's gonna increase his attack and speed, I think? Or just speed? Oh yeah, attack and speed. Ow! There we go. Huh. Well, it's a special attack, so it shouldn't matter. Ooh! Ooh! Yeah. Ow! Should I use an item or should I... I'm thinking... Nah, let's use an item. No, let, let's use the uh, energy boost. After we clear this uh, incident, we are not going to need the energy roots anymore because we are going to do the gym challenge and in that case we are going to get access to real items. Oh, I think I'm going to get... Oh! Okay, I got lucky with that one. Okay, time for another person. Ow! Yeah, I guess this time it was too weak for the game to, you know, make it survive. So sorry everyone. Flashback time. About a year and a half ago. I'm so sorry, I think I went a little too far. Nah, don't worry about it. We're the ones who asked you to put us through some tough battle practice so we can train up. Yeah, but... True, you know, you need not to apologize, my lady. Thanks to Tai's sage instruction, I'm making swift strides towards mastering the art of battle. And I could never have evolved my Pokémon without you, Yuri. Even the big boss says it's thanks to you that we have a fighting chance against our bullies. See, nothing but gratitude to us. You are the brightest star in the whole team. <laughs> come, come on, you're... Quit being silly. Just one team. We've been training for... Four whole hours now, I totally poop. Ah, I'm sorry, you all really should take a break. I'll go run for a while, I'll go run for a while you rest up. My lady, we four have each straight in our own turn, but you, for a steady fast mentor, has rest not once. I cannot help but to worry for thy health. Thank you for your concern, Atticus. But lately, I feel like I can take on anything, no matter how. No matter if I'm tired or feel like crying. Remember that time we all go together and riff on our gym badge designed to create our own very star badges? Well, I don't know what it is, but it's just looking at my star badge makes me feel so strong. Like, I want to give it my all. I give it my all, but it wasn't enough. I wasn't enough. You're right. You weren't enough. I kicked your ass. You show amazing strength, even if the code didn't require me to give it to you. I want you to have this. Okay. I'd like to see you try my trademark move tier. Take this one for you. Oh yeah, you use close combat at some point, I think. With the with the ape. I know you are part of Operation Starfall, but I could tell from our battle that you're not a bad person. The way your Pokémon look at you with such trust gives it away. Do me a favor and look away for a moment. This is a bit, for me, a bit too much for me to take. I just really... Oh, she's crying. Looks like it's Oh, really? Uh, okay. Uh, sorry, I just got... Never mind. Sorry, I digress. This is the Team Star member, you battle at the gate, Shirley. I asked her to come along for a talk. So, what do you want to ask me? You seem to be much friendlier there with Eri compared to the other grunts. Why is it that? Oh, you spotted that? Well, alright, I don't mind telling you. Truth is, I used to hate Riri. She's an amazing trainer and athlete, and she's really pretty too. It took her no time to at all to become popular at the academy. I was queen of the class before she came along, but then everyone liked her more than me. 
So let me guys just start to pickle her. Pretty much. I got our classmates to join in too. We were all so stupid. But in the end, kids are always fickle, and once the thrill wears off, they look for something new. Before long, the class chose me as their next target and started bullying me instead. I guess I deserve it, but then really, she used to help me even though I've been so horrible to her. She told me that she understood how hard it is to have no one on your side, and she invited me to Team Star. Even though you bullied her like that, what a kind girl. She really is, and joining the team has worked out great for us, it's been so much fun. Fun? There are rumors that Team Star like when she gets she bullied. After hearing my story, do you really think that's true? Well, I mean, they were harassing Penny to join them, so it kind of is. Ah, no, I barely. Bree and the rest of Team Star made me who I am today. Please, don't take away your greatest treasure. Mm, my mouth is dry, I've been talking for hours. Ooh, okay, we did this in record time. Sina, it's me. Did you do it? Did you go? Did you claim Mary's star badge? Without its boss, the cap squad should be at the hair spread from spanning. So, Eri was the last. All five squad bosses have now toppled from their pedestals. I imagine they'll leave Team Star before long now that they will lost their special positions. After that, they should be soon back to attending classes at the academy. That sighter kind of floated into the air. Nice work out there, Sina. Is it that Clive I hear? Kashupe, a well done to you too. Thanks. Now about the rewards, Sina. I'll transfer the LP to your phone. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that reminds me. I'm doing the whole supply unit rep thing this time, right? Indeed, you can go ahead and give Sina her bonus rewards now. I thought Penny was going to, you know, collide with Clive on this one. At long last, Operation Starfall has entered its final stage. There's only one thing left on the agenda. You must defeat the big boss and have Team Star disband for good. Don't worry, there is no need to search them out. Their true identity of the big boss is none other than me. Yeah, yeah, big surprise. <laughs> I like Clive's like face. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to keep it from you for so long, but the right moment never came. I'm the one who formed Team Star. Back then, the members of Team of the team were my closest friends, and I treasured them more than anything. If they go on like this, Team Star won't do any good for anyone. They gotta give it up, so I'm using the code we made together to force them out to disband. Sina, I'll be waiting for you at the school door after dark. You should come as well, Clive. Understood. Then I'll see you both there. So, Cassiopeia was the big boss of Team Star this whole time. I scarcely thought possible, but this with this revelation I may have an inkling as to their true identity. It seems we'll find our answers after dark in the academy school year. Let's prepare as best as we can for, for heading up. Okay, I'm gonna finish the episode right here. No, actually, we still have time. So, let's go to... The Pokemon Center, heal, and then capture a boat, uh, a couple of Pokemon, I guess. I mean, we do have time. Gardevoir is already first, so let's capture something, you know, strong, like, well, I guess I take it on the B-Sharp. Okay, I can be flinched, that's nice. Mm, let's start with Hypnosis. Okay, that works. 
and I guess psychic. Although, since uh, there's another thing I forgot to mention, I cannot, uh, like, my chances of capturing high level Pokemon. Oh, he's Dark Type, right. Forgot about that part. Okay, let's try Moonblast then. Okay, that works. So like, uh, if I don't beat the genes, I cannot capture like, uh, like, ch sorry, my chances of capturing higher level Pokemon decreases. That's why I, I was struggling of capturing some of them. Okay, let's see. Yeah, even if it's asleep and everything. Oof. Damn it. Of course, it's a critical. Yeah, let's send out... Hmm. Well, let's send out Pablo. Also, I realize he has all that up, so he, he no longer has a static. Ooh, something happened to the floor. Let's use the revival air. I only have 10 of these, but that's, that's okay, it doesn't matter. And I use Metal Claw without killing him. If I kill him, well, that's it. Alright, yeah, 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 okay. okay. Oh, it's because he's using Iron Defense, right, right, right. That's fine by me. I think one more, and if he kills me, I can just go for Gardevoir and then use Hypnosis. Oh, I fail? Really? Oh well, thank you, use Hypnosis. Bug, right? He's dark still. Timer ball? Yeah, the more turns it has. Okay, let's use the dust ball first. Yes. Oh, damn it! Oh, he, he wakes up really fast. Okay, that was kind of weird. Oh, of course I fail. This is why I didn't also win a capturing spree off screen. 
I was thinking of, but then after I read that, I was like, hmm, maybe it's not convenient to try and capture Pokemon like that. Oh, come on, Gardevoir. You are making me look bad. Oh, really? We are already past the half hour. This was supposed to be something fast. There we go. It's kind of funny how all the other Pokemon are not even like scared or something. That a battle is just going on in front of them. Come on. Let's try the timer ball. Yes! Alright! Mission accomplished. But yeah, as you can see, it's extremely hard. That's why we need to defeat the yeah, Ice Dark Steel, the gym leaders. This Pokemon commands a group of several Ponyard. Groups that are defeated in territorial disputes are absorbed by the winning side. Yeah, I'll I'll think on using a P-Sharp later. As you can see, I even saw a day note. There are some in the caves. But yeah, that's going to be it for this episode. Next time, we're going to finish up this side story. So anyways, enjoyed the video. Leave a like. Have something to say? Comment down below. One more. Please subscribe. Is this video ending? You can bet it is. So I thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.